doing everything correctly. Oh my god, these are adorable. Oh my gosh. These are so cute. These are great for, uh, I will do Aurora nails with these. Very cute. I'll do some like very fun, cutesy spring looks. Does anyone else get stressed out by like how much stuff you get from Shein or not stressed out, but overwhelmed? Okay. These are charms, obviously. They're snowflake charms. But they were kind of pricey for Shein. Shein's usually super duper cheap. But these were <laughs> on the more expensive end for a Shein product. But they're beautiful and I would say that they're worth it. These were $6 for 10. And they're so gorgeous. I love these. Yeah, I'm very happy with these. Look at that. Very pretty. Very shiny. I would say that these compare to a Daily Charm product. I'll even pull out a Daily Charm. This came in the Daily Charm mystery box. This is their snowflake. Alright, so I'll put it here. And then this is the Shein snowflake. I'd say they're comparable. I actually kind of like the Shein color gold better. I mean, they're both gorgeous, but I'm happy with this Shein product. $6 is pricey for Shein, but I think these are nice. So I will put these there. Let's see, what's this? Oh yeah, these. These I feel like were all over the place a while back and I didn't pick them up right away. I don't know why, but I just think that they're a nice little, you know, bonus thing to throw in a nail. That's pretty. Again, I have something similar from maybe it was Donji Nail. I don't know. Maybe it was Zillaboo. Something similar. I can kind of do a comparison video on if you guys want. But I'm happy enough with these. These were inexpensive. They're pretty. I feel like they might not be as nice as the other ones I have. But for the price, I'm pleasantly surprised. What do we got here? Ooh! I've been wanting these to come in. I have a ton of nail stands, but they always break. And, you know, and I make my friends press on. So these stands are very helpful. But what I wanted this for was because these are so tiny. I'm excited for that. Let me do a comparison for how big they usually are. The base is usually really big and I can't usually get my pinky nail on there because the, the, this is just too big for a pinky nail. But this is perfect. Oh, these are tiny. I love these. I want more, I want more. I think I have another set in there but I feel like I need even more. This is so cute. I'm very, very pleased with that. That gives me a lot of joy. Like how perfectly tiny these are for nails. Oh, I'm so excited for that. Put this in the trash. Let's see. Okay, stickers for Valentine's Day. All right, so these are just standard roses. Nothing special to see here. But these are great for Valentine's Day. Whatever this plastic film is on top of it. that XOXO. These are very cute for Valentine's. Yes. Those will go in my Valentine pile. These other ones will just go in my random sticker pile. What's here? <gasps> I love Aurora colors, but these I got for Valentine's Day as well. 
Yeah, Valentine's Day is just around the corner. We're in Christmas season now. And this will be gone before you know it. And then we'll be right into Valentine's. Ugh. I love how, like, the Aurora nails, like, they just glow up. Love, 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 love Aurora nails. I did get another one of these. Pop this puppy out. Yes. I wish I got more than two. Maybe I did and I don't remember. I did buy a lot of stuff, but um, I'm liking these a lot. I wish the magnet was stronger, but you know, it is what it is. I like that like they kind of like fit in with each other. And it fits with my Aurora Obsession right now. So that's nice. Love those. Oh, goodness. Okay. Ooh! Foils. Look at how shiny these are. Oh my goodness, what are these? I don't remember ordering these, but they're so nice. Oh my gosh, these are so nice. Let's look at them on a white background. I feel like you'll see them better. Oh my goodness, look at these. Are these the same color? No, one's darker. Oh my goodness. Oh my God, they have the hollow effect to them. This one's black with hollow. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. These, I don't remember getting these. And I am so excited. Oh my God, I wanna do a set with these immediately. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I feel like I need to like put these somewhere special because I want to do something with them immediately. These are so gorgeous. I want to be gentle with them because the metallic foils, if you bend them too much, like they'll break apart. So I don't want to be too rough with them. Come on. Oh my goodness. These are so exciting to me. Come on. They're delicate. They're very delicate though. I'm not usually like a flashy, flashy kind of gal, but these are so fun. Oh, can't wait. Cannot wait to do something with those. Wow. It's really like the little things in life that give me such joy. I'm going to put these right here because I'm going to remember I want to do something with them. Ooh. These, out. these are gorgeous. I don't know why I bought so many rhinestones. I don't know how to really use rhinestones yet, but hey, if you're going to learn, you might as well learn on Shein, right? Come on. Come on. The static cling makes these just want to like hold on. Ooh, these are pretty. What a pretty color. Let me see which one I can pick up. Pretty colors. Very pretty. I'm not mad at this blue at all. I'm gonna... And so when I get these kinds of charms, I like to like open them up entirely because they can get really sticky the, the first time you use it. So I wanna break it in 
so then they can be easier to use each time thereafter. And some of them spilled out and I will not waste them if I can avoid it. Pretty, pretty. I'm actually going to keep them in the package until I know what I want to do with them. Oh, more Aurora nails. Love. Love, love, love the Auroras. Come on. You can do it. I just love that like they give such different colors with a different background like they they give a green blue here and like this would be such a fun mermaid vibe and then here it's just like this like glowing blue so pretty the aurora nails i gotta do something fun with them Yeah, I already own these. I wanted more as a backup. I just thought these were so beautiful that I felt like I needed backups of these. They're these Christmas charms. They're these wreaths that are just perfect. Perfect shape. They bend. I think that these rival anything I can find on Daily Charm. I just love these. They're just so classy, so elegant, so refined. Love. I give these a 10 out of 10. And they were super inexpensive. I think they were $2. And then I had 20% off. Oh, yeah. So I think these are trying to be marketed as Christmas. Because right here there's some snowflakes. But I got these because they are giving such 4th of July vibes. These are 4th of July. There's no other way around it. Come on. These will be so fun on the 4th. Oh my god. It's this one that like will need to be like deconstructed because like there's like snowflakes, but not a big deal. Like, oh my god, I love it for the 4th. I love it for the 4th. So cute. So again, I'm going to break this all up before I put it back on. Oh my God. This is so cute. Oops. Sorry. Didn't mean to hit that. All right. These are some stickers that... I've been wanting for a while. She and hadn't been carrying the exact kind I wanted. And then when I saw these, I was like, yes. They're like little frames. Ooh, these ones are fun because it has like a little hollow element. I wasn't expecting that, but this is exactly what I wanted. And imagine it with these flowers, like gorgeous. Like this has like a bit of a foggy background, so it's not doing the flowers justice, but very pretty. I wish they were bigger. I thought they would be bigger, but I'm still very, very happy with them. Oh, snake charms. In my last video, I got some snake stickers, but I'm very happy to get these snake charms so I can do some like fun nails together. Oh, these are much better than I anticipated. Oh, yeah. Snake vibes. Very cool. They're the perfect length for like medium nails. I can do a lot with that. I'm wearing right now. These are Daily Charms short almond, I think. Personally, I think this is a medium, but Daily Charm labels it as short and so these are perfect for that perfect <gasps> look 
some ice now, some Aurora charms. These ones are pink. Again, they come in this terrible container. I do not like this container. Why, Shein, are you using these awful containers? Give me something good. Give me those little round doohickeys. But you just screw. Like, what's happening? <laughs> okay. These are going to fly everywhere. This is not easy to do. Come on, Shein. Oh, oh, I feel a corner lifting. But of course it would fly everywhere. Because that's what these things will do. Oh, but these are amazing. <gasps> Look at how pretty it is. Like, this is such a cool pink. I think the camera makes it look more purpley and you can't really see it, but like it looks like fuchsia purpley in person. The white makes it look more pinky peachy, but the black gives it a fuchsia purple vibe. Love these. Don't love its container, but love the gems. gems. These are cute. These have a yellowy shift. Oh my god, when you put them in black, they go to purple. Yeah, in white, they're yellow peach, and then in black, they go purple blue. So much fun. I love that. Okay, so I think these are the same as these. Is it the same skew? Yep. So I'll just throw these in with it. Put them together. Merge them. They're the same anyway. Yeah, a lot of the things I got, I got twos of. So, yeah, I have this already. I showed it in my last video. I had these before. I loved them, so I got more. Yep, just love them. They have, like, that plastic film. I don't know why these Shein stickers have these plastic films on it. I've been wanting these. I'm sorry if I've been out of frame. Here. Put this back down. It helps me stay in frame. Oh, and I need water. Oh, excuse me. Got a little parched. So these are for Valentine's Day. They're roses, but they have that whole Aurora feel. They're smaller than I thought, which I actually like. I like that they're a little. It gives me more I can do with it. Very cute. They they have different vibes depending on the background, but I like. I think there's thirty in here. Ooh, yellow. I don't do enough with yellow. I feel like I sleep on yellow. So let's see what happens when we put it on black. Ooh, they still have a yellow hue, but they shift to purple. These are fun.
yellow. These will be fun in like the summer. Yeah, those will be a fun summer color. Oh, nice. I have these in white. And then when I saw them in pink, I was like, uh, don't mind if I do. They're very nice, though. You can use boba gel and almost make like little charm necklaces and stuff with them. Yeah, these are nice. Very delicate, very dainty. Pearls! Oh! But these have like a cool texture to them. There's a lot in here. So these are like white, silvery, but they <laughs> should not have put them in a thing that where they can exit. Let's do over. <laughs> and now it doesn't want to exit. These have a really cool texture. I think this will be nice for Christmas nails. Woo, woo. I have something similar from Daily Charm. They're gold and silver and these are white. So I feel like these are a nice addition. Some, like weird black thingy in here. What is this? What's happening to this pearl? It has like muck on it. All right, I cleaned it off. Who knows what that was? The cooties I just touched. These are nice. What a cool texture. Definitely will be adding those to some Christmas nails. Ooh, yeah. So these are more Auroras, but these were fun because they had like a little mix of everything. I hate these containers because I never open them correctly. I spill them everywhere. But we're not going to mess with opening them because I jack it all up. But I love that there were black ones. And there were just some colors that I didn't have for individual packs that I love. Such as the black. I'm going to leave these in this. Even though I want to take them out and play, I just know... I almost up. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at the shine. Let's see what happens if I put a black background under any of them. Ooh. Oh my goodness. The black with the black. Yes. Oh my God, the green. All of them. Oh my gosh, look at the, these. I, I, I can't. I need to do something with these. I have to do an unpotting video with all of these. Stay tuned. Like and subscribe, I should say. If you like and subscribe, you'll know when I have an unpotting video. Oh, these are simple. You can just like use them for placing rhinestones in the center of it to give it a nice little zhuzhing up of a rhinestone. Come on. A little extra zhuzh. I don't know what to call it. But yeah. You guys have probably seen someone use these to put a rhinestone in the middle of it. Come on. You know what? I want to see what these blue rhinestones would look like with that. Let's just do it on the paper because it'll be easier. Oh, this blue one's too big. Let's do one slightly smaller. Uh, the blue is too big, but like you get the picture. It's cute. It's cute. Let's try a slightly smaller blue. There it is. 
Look at that. Pretty. You can do that with any of these things. And I have a bunch of them. I have them in all sorts of colors. So let's put these away. Of course, more Aurora. I might have bought these in a previous haul and just got extras. Not sure. These, this color looks familiar. Yeah, I think I bought these before. Beautiful. Like this might be one of my favorites. I am a bit of a mess. Green. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting green to turn pink. That is a shocking discovery. <gasps> wow. That's what makes these so cool. Like, depending on the background you put it on, it changes it. Like, on a beige background, it's different than that, and it's different than that. I just, I can't get over how cool they are. So like, yeah, they almost look white and then, ah, oh, they're just awesome. I just can't get over it. Okay. So these are like a stone like embellishment. I got them because I gave a Japanese nail vibe. This packaging is gross. <laughs> what is going on with this? Feels like, look, it's dirty. This is packed to the brim. But um, yeah, it gave um like a nuanced nail art vibe, kind of like what I see with a lot of the Japanese or Korean nail artists. And I love what they do. I just think what they do is beautiful. So I wanted to see this to see, you know, if it was given what I was wanting it to give. It's, I thought it would be more pinky than it is not super pink oh why am I a mess uh. I mean they're cool now that I see all these different shapes it's kind of good that I spilled this everywhere they're cool I can see myself doing something with this in the spring it has like a nice spring ambiance to it okay I will not be keeping that cute oh yeah more of these I think I have another packet I opened elsewhere like in the previous video I won't open these but yes like magic magic look at that magic it's just magical Ooh, butterfly glitter. That's like this really pretty shade of gold. I'm not going to do anything with that, actually. I'm not going to open it other than to like look at it pretty. I just wanted to encapsulate this because I just think the color of gold was so pretty. And I just feel like... This is like the perfect way to practice encapsulation. Again, this is like something I want to do something with immediately. Because I want to practice the encapsulation process. Okay, what's this? Oh, yep, more of these nail tips. Don't need to open those. Love these. I love this. It's caviar beads. 
in different sizes, but they're only halves of them. Oh, this one was a little open. I'm surprised stuff didn't fly everywhere. So they'll sit nicely. But look at all the sizes and colors. This is nice. I don't want to take these out. I don't even want to open them up because they'll fly everywhere. These are nice. I'm excited for this. Oh, pretty. I feel like these would make for some really nice Christmas nail art. So I'm going to put them in my Christmas pile. Oh, okay. Not my typical thing. But like, they're pretty. I have these in white. I have these in white. These feel very regal. Feel very, uh, very fancy. It's like the color of Kate Middleton's engagement ring. That's fun. I mean, <clears throat> I look at it and I think they're pretty. I know it's not the highest quality of stone. It's kind of cloudy, but It'll be fun to play with and to practice nail art with. Like I, I've said, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I want to learn. Look, these go together so nice. Oh, that'll be pretty. That'll be a fun set. Ooh, ooh I think I have already opened these. Look. Love. I think maybe that's what I should start doing with these. Is just putting them like that to like get a good sense of like white and black background. Pretty. These turn such a pretty purple. Okay, what's going on over here? Oh, more of these stickers. I'm going to unpackage them because it'll be easier for me to later on organize. Oh, yep. This is also very common in Japanese nail art, these bars. These are long. I have short ones. I just didn't have anything this long. And these are very pretty. They're very shiny. I am very satisfied with this. It's long, but it's supposed to be. You can just like embed it. It doesn't want to sit. Um, that's very pretty. Oh, what is wrong with me? Oh, goodness. Okay, come on. These don't want to pick up. I'll get you, my pretty. Okay. I guess I need to get a tool. Sorry, guys. I'm sure this part is very boring that I'm just sitting here picking this up. And you're like, why didn't wouldn't you edit this out? Well, because this is my hobby. I'm not trying to turn it into a career. So I'm not trying to perfect anything. So if I have to start editing videos, it won't be fun. I don't think editing is a fun process. I've tried it with other things. I don't enjoy it. And so I'm just not going to do the stuff I don't enjoy. So hopefully you don't mind these boring parts of me cleaning up. These are pretty. I recommend. More Aurora. Very pretty. I don't even know how much Aurora I have at this point, but it's a lot. It's a lot of Aurora. Oh yeah, I have these already. I just have another set. It's just, you can't really see, I bet, but it's just moon, stars, unicorns, that vibe. Oh, these went everywhere. <laughs> these... Again, aren't my usual vibe, but you know, it's Christmas time. And so these will be fun to do something with. Oh my goodness. 
Let's put these all in their little homes. Everything needs to go in its home. Come on. Let's look at this. Oh, I'm really pleased with that. That's very pretty. And like I have these from a previous haul and they go very nicely. Are these the same green? I believe so. So I'm happy with that. Oh yeah. I've seen these on the site and blue and white. Is that horse eye? Is that what that's called? These are pretty. I'm pleased. Not my usual MO, but happy regardless. What I like is that like, I think these come in pairs maybe. Let me see something here. Do you have a sister? That's not your sister. You're close though. Mm, no, not all of them have sisters. A lot of them do though. Hmm. I'll have to spend some time looking at this in depth because I think oftentimes they have sisters or are they all unique and I'm just not realizing that. Am I silly? Are these all unique? They might all be unique <laughs> without me realizing. They're all pretty. Let's put them back in and I don't want them flying everywhere. I'm going to even put them in here because I don't want them flying all over their little case. <clears throat> okay. Oh, more Aurora hearts. These are bigger, I think, than the other ones I got. They're pretty. I like them better on a white background. They're more green on beige. More purpley yellow on black, but pink on a white background. I like that. I like them pink. What do we got? Oh, more nails. I don't need to open those. What's this? Oh, oh my gosh. These are way prettier than I was anticipating. Oh my goodness. Oh, and it has like a little sprinkle cap. Stop it. Oh my God. And it's like these little micro Aurora flakes. Oh my gosh. These are to die for. I, part of me wants to like keep these tucked away for spring. But another part of me wants to use these immediately because they're just so pretty. <gasps> I don't remember what I paid for these, but I'm obsessed. They're like flakes. They're not sequins glitter. They're flakes. Oh my gosh. I don't know what to do. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know if I should use these right away. Wait for spring. Or wait. Because I did a daily charm haul for their Black Friday polishes. And I bought a ton. And I have colors that would go with this. I don't know. They're beautiful. And imagine like a whole like rainbow set of these. I feel like I need to put them in rainbow order. I feel like I need I need them to be in rainbow order immediately. Yeah, 
guys, look at these in rainbow order. Can I get them in the screen? Look at these in rainbow order. Why are you so perfect? This is what dreams are made of. This is like unicorn joy. Wowzers, I'm so happy. Put these away. I think. Uh, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I want to tuck these away and pull them out in spring. Or I want to use them right away. I think I want to use them in the near future. I think these need to be used sooner rather than later. Those were amazing. What do we got? Oh, I'm not going to go wild and open this up because I have this opened already. This is this. Um, it's this little like box of rhinestones and pearls and some charms, all Christmas themed. And I wanted to get a backup in case I go through this and I'll want this next year. I love I don't like the packaging, but I love the idea of this mix all in one because then like if I'm feeling like I feel like doing nails, I don't know what inspires me. I can pull a mix like this out and do a whole set just based off of what's in this. So I'm excited for that. I'll put you away until next year. What's this? What's this? Ooh, these are stars. Oh, this will be cute for Christmas. Look at these stars. Come on. You can do it. Do you see it? Oh, they're pretty. They're pretty for Christmas. And I can use them again for 4th of July. And I can use them for out of space nails. And... They're just perfection and I love them. So I shall enjoy. Okay, what's this? Oh, back up snowflakes. I have these already. I'm not gonna take them out of the packaging because I have them. Nope, that's not it. I have these right here. They're perfect. So I just wanted backups because I'm probably gonna go through these fast and the Christmas season. Or probably not. I only do my nails. So, like, I don't know why I'm... Well, I don't only do my nails. I do my friend's nails. Hey, if you want me to do a, <laughs> a press-on nail set for you, and you know your nail sizes, you can always message me, and I would happily make you a Christmas set or any other set. Already went through this. Love these. What do we got? Ooh, more snake nails. Pretty. Black and white. Gold. Oh my god, I was excited at the idea of these because they give me like tattoo vibes. <laughs> so cute. I think I should take them all out of their packaging. It'll allow me to put them away easier when it's time to put them away. And you can see the snakes. These are so pretty. I love the little bees. Look at the bees. I had an idea for a bumblebee set this summer and I never got to it. So that'll be fun to like incorporate with that. At first, I was like, should I put these in my Halloween pile? But then, no, because, like, I kind of want to do these randomly during the year. I think maybe what I'm going to do is create some sort of, like, situation where, like, I have to reach into a bag and pull out a random piece of nail art and make a nail set with it. Another YouTube creator came up with that idea. I'm stealing it. I can't remember her name. So it's not my idea, but like this would be fun to do that with. As would the little snake charms I have. Oh! These are 
so silly. I, I don't think I would ever be able to wear these on my actual nail because I would like, they would drive me bonkers, but like, I love them. And I want to do a fun like nail set with them. But also I have a friend who loves pink and I think she would love these on her nails. So they're magnets. So you can take it on and off when you shower or do your dish. Oh my God, that's a strong magnet. I was going to say you can take them on and off for when you shower or do the dishes. But like, that's a strong magnet. But like they're fluzz, fluffy. They're so soft. Oh my goodness. <gasps> these would be so cute on a Valentine's Day set. Oh, I'm happy with that. I'm a little confused by this odd packaging, but it's like little baggy instead of a little baggy. But those are cute. Okay, so I think I'm getting to the point in this box where like there's going to start being tons of duplicates. Like we already went through this. Ugh. Let's see. We already went through that. Yeah, these and these are the same. I'm going to keep this in the packaging and save it for next year. Oh, for Christmas. So I had these in green. So clearly I got them in red, but these ones don't come in special packaging. Oh my gosh, this is a big boy. I don't really like that color red too much. But, huh. These are, oh my gosh, for Valentine's Day. Oh, I would love that on Valentine's Day because they're not too intrusive. They're not too high. That's very pretty. Oh, I like that they send you, what is it, four of each, maybe five? I think they send you five of each kind and there's four different kinds left. Okay, yeah. So it's five of each kind, and there's four kinds. Hmm, they're cute. I'm pleased. I don't think you can see all of them, but they're cute. I'm happy. Oh boy, this video is getting long. I might have to take a break soon because I feel myself getting tired. Oh, these are caviar beads, but they got a cool little color to them. Come on. Yeah, these aren't normal. Cav oh my God, they're different sizes. That's why there's two of them. I thought they were the same size. I'm not going to open them up because they'll fly everywhere, but they have like an Aurora shift to them but they're caviar beads these are so cute oh my gosh i love these okay i am gonna pause here and take a little bit of a break because there's still so much to unbox